Hello guys, Miss Taco Phobia here today. Today I've got a different type of healing build, not a um, future initiative, but I'm using the striker skill set as a healer build. It's pretty good guys, and uh, if you like my content and you want more videos in the future, like and subscribe, and let's get into it. The first piece we're using is the striker mask. Two piece gives you 15% weapon handling, three piece gives you 15% rate of fire, four pieces strikers gamble. Weapon hits increase total weapon damage by 0.65%, so that can go up to 100 times. One stacks loss per second between 0 and 50. Two stacks loss per second between 50 and 100 stacks. We've rolled it to a skill tier. We have repair skills and we have 18.8% repair skills mod. Our second piece of striker is the holster roll to a skill tier. The attribute is 20% repair skills. Our third piece of striker is the knee pads, roll to a skill tier and 20% repair skills. Our fourth piece of striker is the gloves, roll to a skill tier and 20% repair skills. The backpack we're using is the Alp Summit back pack, 20% repair skills. Skill tier the attributes are 12% skill haste and 20% repair skills and the mod is 19.9% repair skills and the talent we're using to help the team is opportunistic enemies you hit with his, with shotguns and marksman rifles amplifies the damage they take by 10% from all sources for 5 seconds this is pretty good guys the chest piece we're using is a Hana U piece we get 10% skill haste it's a skill tier, the attributes are 20% repair skills and the other attribute is 8% skill damage but if you make this build try and get a skill haste instead of skill damage but the mod is 19.9% repair skills and the talent is empathic resolve repairing an ally increases their total weapon and skill damage by 3 to 15% for 20 seconds 1 to 7% if self effectiveness increased by your skill tier so we'll get maxed out of that. Primary weapon we're using guys is the capacitor exotic assault rifle. Core attributes are 15% assault rifle damage, 12% damage to armor, 9% health damage. And the talent is shooting enemies build stacks at a cap of 40, each stack grants 1.5% skill damage after 5 seconds. <coughs> stacks decay 1 per second. But we're ignoring that guys, we're not using the gun for that. We're using it for each skill tier gain, we gain 7.5% weapon damage, which is a pretty nice amount of uh, weapon damage. Those are the mods. And we're also using it for the 12% damage to armor. The secondary we're using is the lefty named shotgun. The core attributes are 15% shotgun damage, 12% damage to armor, 10% damage to toxic out of cover. And the talent is perfect sledgehammer. Dealing damage with a grenade applies a mark on target. Target with mark will take 40% more damage to armor and have minus 30% movement speed. Mark will disappear after 10 seconds. Those are the mods I'm using. And the sidearm I'm using is the orbit name pistol. Core attributes 15% pistol damage, attributes 10% damage to target out of cover. Talent is perfect finisher, swapping from this weapon within 10 seconds of killing an enemy grants 35% crit click chance and 40% crit click damage for 15 seconds. The first skill I'm using is the reinforcer chem launcher. It will be skill tier 6 and uh, those are the mods. I don't have another mod guys but you can get a 7% uh, mod for healing. The secondary skill I'm using is the restorer hive. T6 and those are the mods. This is the overall build. It's actually pretty good guys, actually pretty hard. Pretty, it actually hits pretty hard considering it's a, it's a uh, skill build, healer build, but uh, you contribute to the team, you help the team by having damage. Obviously guys, this is just a, a build for people that just like to experiment with stuff obviously this is not the best healing build you can make that is future initiative but I just made this just for some fun but uh, we're using the survivalist specialization because we get flame grenades and we can throw them 
to proc perfect sledgehammer which people will get loads more weapon damage because they get 40% more damage to armor and obviously because it's the perfect sledgehammer it's a shotgun so when you shoot the enemy as well you will proc opportunistic for your team so you'll get your benefit in your team twice plus you get a talent from specialization where if you set enemies on status <coughs> your teammates get more weapon damage as well but uh, I'll show you the stats we're using the survivalist specialization the reason we're using this is because 15% increased outgoing healing when you pop a med kit, it will apply to your friends, your teammates within 20 meters. And because you get the flame grenades, which is good for the talent sledgehammer on your weapon. We also get group members get 10% bonus damage to targets with status effects. So when you throw your grenade, then you've got sledgehammer. This is also applying to your teammates, so they get more weapon damage as well. But uh, this is just a build to mess around with, guys. This is not the best healing build, like I said before. This is just a different type of healing build. It's just so you feel that you're helping with damaging them enemies yourself as well. But if you like this, guys, give it a go. And uh, have a great day. Clean up the rest of the black tusk or we can call today a win. 